go away. Save your questions. Just leave me in peace. But... Leave now. Don't make me tell you again. Honorary Knight, Venti, and Paimon. I'm so glad you guys are here. I've been looking for you everywhere. I wanted to thank you again for helping me find the sword and shield. My parents are finally supporting me. Oh, really? Yeah, really. They even said they're going to pay for someone to fix up the Sword of Brilliant Valor and Shield of Magnificent Honor for me, so I can take them out on the road. That's wonderful! So, Jack, is this the part where you bid farewell to Mondstadt and set off on your intrepid trip traversing to Vat? No, not yet. I still don't have what it takes to go too far from home just yet. Besides, I'm sure Stanley still has a few stories left to tell. <laughs> They're what inspired me to become an adventurer in the first place. Stanley, I... Oh, you're drunk again. We'll see you tomorrow then. After your hangover wears off, maybe you can tell me some more of your stories? Stanley's really fond of that kid, don't you think? Uh, Jack. Jack. Jack left. Oh, I see. Well, thank you for not telling him about my secret. Huh? All of a sudden, you're facing the facts? That isn't like you. Just now, I couldn't bear to look at him. His adventurous spirit is so pure, unblemished. Just a weary old feckless fraud. But that kid is a brand new shining star, full of potential. I cannot allow his dreams to be crushed. Mm, you're not a total fraud. Stanley's adventure stories and experiences. They're all true, aren't they? Stories? Experiences? What's the point of them anymore? To be honest, my memories of adventuring and of Stanley, they're hazy these days. That's my biggest secret of all. And my biggest fear. All these years, I've been living to tell his story. But his personality and the details of his life, I don't remember them clearly anymore. <laughs> But the one thing I can never forget is that he died in a windless land where his spirit can never be recovered. Exactly. Even in his memory, the real Stanley isn't the living, breathing friend he knew at all. Instead, he's become fixed on the image of him as that battle-scarred warrior, and that image has held him captive his entire life. I'm too old. I never let go. But still, so much has slipped away. I'm completely and utterly worthless. No adventurer should have to go that way. No adventurer ever. Hans Archibald. <sighs> My true name? How did you know? <laughs> I can hear the wind blowing in the Mare Javari. I always believed you existed. Will you hand me your old friend's spirit? Thank you, Lord Barbados. I'm sorry. It's gonna take me some time to calm back down. But I think that I'm gonna be okay. Ah, wonderful! Stanley reconnected with his true self and Jack can finally go his own way. This calls for a celebration! And by celebration, I do, of course, mean libation. And by libation, you mean you're not leaving this tavern till you're too drunk to walk, right? <laughs> no, the wine here's too expensive. Jack still owes me some wine, though. He promised me a rare vintage in exchange for helping him out, remember? I'll head off to fetch the wine. 
See you shortly. Let's meet at the usual place. Huh? Where's that supposed to be? 